With the latest Far Cry 5 update, Ubisoft secretly added some new items to the game, including items from the upcoming Vietnam DLC, and they also rolled back one big change from update 1.06. So let's talk about it in this video, if you enjoyed that, then a like would be super appreciated and let's go! Let's start with some interesting new items that started to pop up in the shop as noted by Pick Eliza Color on Twitter and I hope I pronounced that right, namely new bubble hats for in your car. We got a little cheeseburger bubble hat that looks to be the same as the one you can find in the world, but I don't think that you could unlock them yet for in your car and there's also this Hours of Darkness one that likely unlocks if you have the first deal that launches on June 5th. Good to note is that this Hours of Darkness one is now in the Ubisoft Club section of the game, but again it probably unlocks if you got the DLC installed. But here we can already take a look at what it will look like in the game, and by the way the text is in Dutch, I'm sorry about that. The look of this bubble hat already leaked thanks to the PlayStation 4 dashboard, that's Design UI, took a screenshot of that. But we also got another one that is not in the game yet, but did appear on the PlayStation 4 dashboard as well, thanks to Rise gaming awesome who reached out to me on Twitter with some sort of leak I think you can call it for a bubble hat from Assassin's Creed we see had to be here of course one of the targets you need to kill a priest with a blue scarf so maybe if you got Assassin's Creed Origins you will unlock this one as well but again, while the other two are already like in the game, already in the shop, this one only showed up on the dashboard of the PlayStation 4. So maybe we will see it soon, but no info on that yet. Before we take a look at some more Vietnam DLC items that are already in the game, first some quick reminders. The MP34 weapon is now out for everyone and you can buy it for $7,200 or 400 silver bars. Sadly, there's no skin for the weapon, just the scopes and other regular attachments. There is of course this Rai and Sons variant that was a reward from the live event, so that is the only skin for this weapon that there is, but now we got the regular version in the game as well. While it's not like really strong, it's still a pretty cool weapon, especially because of the magazine on the side of course, totally fun to use. And you might already see the blue gloves I'm wearing here while using the weapon, and that is from the community challenge from the new live event that is going on right now. I already made a video on that, but now the community challenge is finished on all the platforms so if you killed some Paggies with a melee weapon looted their thief you can now claim this outfit the live event section of the game was bugged though so I claimed it through the Ubisoft club section and it also should work on your phone another interesting thing I kind of already touched on in my update 1.06 video but I just quickly browsed over it were the assets for the upcoming Vietnam DLC so in the arcade editor of the Far Cry arcade you can of course make levels and you can use objects from many other games but also from this first paid DLC to for example create your own outpost or assault. These assets are free for everyone by the way so also if you don't own the season pass you can still put these structures in a map or play the maps that other people put together. So yes that basically means that right now before the release of the Hours of Darkness DLC on June 5th you can already get a taste of this expansion. So I'm not cut out for this as you already see here but some people are for example this map I found on the PlayStation 4. It's called Vietnam War from Killerville and I put a link to the sort of web version of this map so you can already click on it, add it to your favorites and then play it yourself. So he uses of course also assets from the DLC and it already gives you a good idea of what running around in the forest area of the Hours of Darkness will feel like. So I totally recommend you check that one out and we also got one on Reddit num68 from a smited ash also co-op or a solo map and this one is on the Xbox One so I think just search a NAM68 and you'll be able to check it out. So it's pretty cool that if you are eager to try the new DLC but can't wait till June 5th you can already go to the arcade mode to get a taste. If you got an awesome Vietnam map yourself totally let me know in the comments down below feel free to share it. But yeah, they already put this stuff in, while if we look at the DLC release calendar, it suggests that the assets would launch on the same time as the DLC. Again, June 5th it will launch, keep a close eye out on the channel for a lot of coverage regarding the Vietnam content. Also interesting regarding the arcade mode is that Ubisoft rolled back one big change they introduced with update 1.06, 
they made regarding the public lobbies. So a few days ago the game went down for maintenance and they introduced a hotfix that now lets you again pick a map from the featured, one from the best rated, but also from the map pick slots with a 45 seconds pick. While with the update 1.06, so before this change, they removed the pick a map phase from the public lobbies, so maps were automatically picked from the featured top rated and replay map slot. So that meant that new maps could not be featured in the public lobbies. And if you are a creator, it was really hard to get your map out there and so that people would play it. A lot of people were not happy about that, so Ubisoft quickly fixed it. They are still working on a fix for the disappearing season pass and pre-order weapons though for the main game the last update we got is on twitter here that they're still looking into it so hopefully they fix it soon it has been more than a week now so i don't know what's taking them so long but when we know more i will of course let you know here on the channel subscribe for everything far cry 5 i will be all over the new dlc once it hits drop a like to support the channel and i will speak to you next time goodbye